first uh, met, met up with the hybrid team back in 2011 um, as Lola Composites. We were at that moment in time. We met their CEO, Steve McLennan. Um, they had a, a desire to, to build a, a large air vehicle to support the US military. I personally, in fact, was involved in a lot of the stress analysis of the mission module and the, the manufacturing engineering of it, the materials selection, etc. And so built a good working relationship with the technical people there. Uh, Paul Jackson, my business partner, built relationships on the commercial side. So we know the people very well, we know the project very well. We know what they need uh, and, and how they work. So we found Ford Composites because we were looking for a company that had a mixture of automotive and aerospace experience and they seemed to fit the bill exactly. So HAV came to Ford Composites because they had a structure that they wanted modifying, strengthening. Um, this vehicle's for, for heavy lift and uh, we were previously involved with this program as, as Lola and uh, we can offer this end-to-end -end capability from sort of CAD design engineering through to tool design and manufacture and then component design and manufacture. As well as that we offer structural analysis capability which, uh, which once again really adds value to this type of program. What we're doing now is converting a space that was a, a cargo space for a military surveillance vehicle into something much more flexible, a huge space that can be used for many different types of demonstrations to our customers. The biggest challenge here at Hybrid Air Vehicles is to build a large lightweight aerospace structure at lower cost and in shorter time scales than would normally be possible in aerospace. The challenge with the customer was uh, in time, in cost and weight primarily. Um, as forward we, we really endeavour to balance those and deliver the best solution to our customer both commercially and, and in terms of their technical objectives. Overall this project is about a £100 million project to create a vehicle which has the ability to move cargo around the world at much lower cost and with much lower environmental impact than anything else available in aerospace. The payload module, which we're working on with Ford Composites, produces the cargo space that we're going to use to demonstrate that. It's got low carbon emissions, it's very quiet, very lightweight, a lightweight vehicle, and obviously that, that's where, our, where Ford comes in. We build lightweight structures and we'd like to think we're really adding value to this program. And uh, it's an exciting program, it's due to fly the end of quarter one and, uh, and from that point I think uh, hopefully the, the air vehicles will set, there'll, there'll be more air vehicles sold and, uh, and be more business for, uh, for, for the surrounding community. The MIA recognise opportunities for motorsport type companies and can introduce them to those opportunities and I think the IET can assist in that process to bring in a level of knowledge beyond motorsport 